Hi folks, Max from GalaxyS4Root.com for this week's ROM of the Week. Check out Jelly Beans ROM. Uh, this ROM is geared towards users who want kind of AOSP look, but stability of TouchWiz. This is built on the latest MDK, not the latest, but um, if you're on ME7, you're probably stuck uh, without root. This is MDK, Android 4.2.2, Verizon firmware. I've used these ROMs on my Verizon Note 2. Actually, it's one of my daily drivers. Um, on my Verizon Note 2. He makes some great ROMs. Uh, all of his ROMs are highly recommended because it gets, it's basically a stock firmware with all the bloatware removed with some cool feature added in, uh, such as the mobile hotspot working out of the box. Um, so that will work out of the box and 4G LT working just fine. Um, so for those of you who need mobile hotspot, this is a great ROM to install and also will get rid of your bloatware. And also multi-window bar has been uh, blackened out which is kind of cool and this has been enabled for all apps natively you don't have to use a separate app um, you just start multitasking uh, with your favorite apps right away for example I installed Dolphin browser which is not normally supported um, now I can multitask with my Google Maps or you can even multitask with your mobile hotspot um, so that's nice that is very nice and the shutter sound uh, has been removed from the camera if you want to use that and also there is pop-up browser uh, super su for uh, root now let me show you some of the cool features uh, customizations you can do if you go to my device uh, you'll find custom settings uh, rom control you'll be able to change some, uh, some stuff here uh, long press kill button you can set this to the menu button uh, what this will do is when you're on the internet or something and you just want to kill the app you know sometimes you download this app and it just freezes or something then go ahead and hold down the menu button and boom shakalaka it kills it right away so that's nice and also uh, lock screen mods um, lock screen sounds home wake if you want to disable the home button from waking this phone you can uh, tap that button also music control uh, if you want to control your music in the lock screen you can change the button delay um, you can change what these buttons do like volume up you want to skip to the next track play stop same thing with the volume down that's pretty awesome uh, for those of you who listen to music often uh, from work to your house in the BART or bus this makes it uh, easy and uh, also some clock options I have a center clock here I've changed my clock to red uh, you can even add days of the week if you want and p.m. style all that good stuff status bar mods you can change the status bar color if you want um, you can change your battery icon a bunch of different batteries uh, some basic UI customization but certainly uh, it's all embedded in here I like it and also battery bar oh so a lot of good stuff and there's actually some more features I'm not going to go into all of them but I just show you some of the, my favorite features and also this ROM does have all that security stuff from Verizon removed um, so no one's gonna be no, not the gov the government isn't gonna be watching over you uh, behind the scenes. So another reason to install a custom ROM, um, so you can get all that crap removed. Um, other than that, pretty nice ROM. Love it. Should give you pretty good battery life over stock and also very good performance. Jelly Beans ROM, um, you know, always made for the Verizon phones. Now it's available for S4. And one of the best developers I've been using is ROM since the S3 Note 2, now the S4. Highly recommend it. If there's one ROM you can install on the Verizon S4, it's definitely this one. And this one, you know, even though the developer updates it very frequently, um, you can still get by for a long time on the previous versions. Um, so definitely one of the best ROMs. If you're looking for one good ROM to install, you don't want the blowware, you want some extra features hotspots, uh, multi-window enable for all apps, um, you know, faster performance, better battery life. This is it, folks. So check it out for this week's ROM of the Week for the Verizon S4. And do let me know what you think, but I think you will love it. Uh, and as always, if you have a uh, Galaxy S4, any of the Galaxy S4s, don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxyS4root.com. We update you once a week with ROM of the Week tips, hacks, and more. Oh, and I forgot to tell you, since this is a Verizon-based firmware, you might be able to get away without doing a data white factory reset so you can keep all your settings apps without you know backing them restoring i still recommend doing a backup rom um, just in case then you can always go back um, you know 
and uh, that, yeah, that's about it. And if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button from here. Subscribe button down there. And have a great weekend, folks. And I'll see you guys soon. Uh, stay high on Android.